Yes, the real media. KJAG Radio and KMA Entertainment, your source for entertainment news and interviews in Central and South Central Kansas. Yeah. The best of the best are here, and we go above and beyond to bring you the most bang for your buck. Find us on the social sites like Facebook and Twitter. Log on to kjagradio.com and jiggyjaguar.com for more. Thank you. Good night. Are we going? Welcome to Jiggy Jag TV, live as live can get from John Barleycorn in the great air capital, Wichita, Kansas. Jigman Freud with you, and it is going down like two hoes on a pimp in an elevator. There we go. And we got animosity. What are you doing? Same shit I always do. <laughs> Stay out the people way. Just stay out. You got a red carpet. I do. Got a red Holy carpet. crap! It's because it's an Aftermore thing. We gotta make it a big deal because they a big deal. It's a big event. Big people. You did. You big know, egos. Big heads even. Gonna be big the egos. Where's my game? I mean, the thing is. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna send a quick shout out to uh, anybody hating. Uh, if you're hating. Please hate me a little bit more if you want to. Hate Aftermore some more. <laughs> hate Polly's <laughs> Productions some more. Then, uh, hate, hate, hate comedian Brandon Wynn some hate more. Hate him too. Hate Marley Corn. <laughs> hate Marquis. Hate, hate, hate having even it, got a Marquis. Get a shot of the Marquis. There you go. Hate all that. Okay, that's, that's now, good. branding. I see you everywhere and you're always wearing your stuff. Hey, if I don't wear it, who going to wear this shit? <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's going to be my philosophy. Uh, you know, I try to make something to where, you know, if I, if I don't like it, I don't want to wear it. I don't want to put my brand on it. I don't want to have my image associated with it. So definitely, that's the only reason why. I honestly didn't know that that's all I wear, to be honest with you, till recently. To somebody was like, damn, every time I see you. And I was just like, well, I just it just kind of evolved that way. The more designs I had, the more looks I would try to come up with. So yeah, I, I guess I predominantly wear only animosity shit, I guess. It's a, it's a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. <laughs> it's a lifestyle. <laughs> we got Aftermore, Polly's Productions. We, we're doing it big. We're in Barley Corn. Now, the last time that I seen you, yes, yes, you were doing, you were out here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was cold. <laughs> Yes, it was, it was cold. very cold, I that. I that. and I didn't have my lights yet, so it was very that. dark in yeah, the back. But you still had a light. <laughs> I still, I still share that every now and then, man. That was like one of my first uh, times even being interviewed. You know, that was really early in my career. That was yep. shortly after I released my first album. So being able to, you know, be a part of anything that you were doing now and even back then was always dope. Because I mean, yep. Jiggy's always been not only always involved in something, but always trying to show love to everybody, whether it's rock, hip hop metal whatever it is comedy radio airwaves it's always been a beautiful thing man it's always been love now you. now uh you have been very busy from what i see on yeah, social busy, media man. what what what, what what is going on with you currently i've been busy man really i, I started a skateboard line so um the, my decks have been doing real well um the shirts the clothing lines been doing great yeah i've really got into uh, doing more events Event based shit, you know, so so it's been a big it's been a big thing, man. Yeah, I've, I've been real cool. busy. A lot more shit out of town, um, especially since the skate shops are carrying the brand a lot all over town. So yeah, it's been a, it's been a it's been a major move. You have a reason to tour. Yeah, I do, man. I try to stay busy. I try to stay on the road. I try to stay away from here. I love Wichita, but um, you know, you gotta try to branch out. You gotta try to get out of here on your own, you know, and uh, yeah. try to see what you what you what's really going on, you know. That's like, cool. You know, what's what's really up out there. That's know? right. You know. Now, uh, any any impressive artists that you've been seeing out there on the road that maybe need a little bit of a, a push or a shout out or anything? I uh, actually, you know, I've been listening to a Bright Guys. That's like a metal band, though. You know, I think they're really dope. I'm a huge Split Lip Rayfield fan. You know, they don't need any help from anybody. Uh, you know, doing what they. I, th do. I think they're doing fine. I think they. I think they're doing all right. Uh, I'm gonna say I've been listening to uh, this dude Thane. I think Thane is pretty hot. I think with a little, with some love and uh, you know, some uh, some little things. You know, I think he could be That's hot. That's cool. I think Krim Dell is getting it in. Uh, I love everything about him. He's a dope dude. Um, you know, works hard, grinds hard. I just think uh, AMC as well. You know, they out there hard. You know, anybody that wants to get out there and work. Everybody wants to say, put me on, let me get a show, but what do you really bring to the table? It was the same for me. I was that same dude standing in the fucking sh stage, standing behind it, standing on the side, it just let me do anything. Let me rhyme, let me carry y'all shit. 
But these days, that's that's not the norm. You know, everybody just sends you a random email that you, from somebody you never heard of. Talking about put me on. Well, having shit like this costs money. Having these events are a risk. Yep. And so, you know, what do you really want to bring to the table? I think that's what's missing today is that, you know, just people don't really want to work hard and put that extra step, that extra move, you know, to really show people that, hey, man, I'm really trying to be a part of what you're doing. Yep. I've got something to offer. You know, let's make something happen. So that's just what I've always been about, man. Showing people the way, showing some love, and they give love back. You know, I would stop by these dudes. They was like, man, we just want to thank you. You just be appreciate all you've done all that you've done for us it wasn't even necessary because they did all this this is all them you know yeah. what i mean be nice to them they put their name up there yep. they got this pop so you know shout out to them shout out to after more man shout out to everybody out there trying to really do it you can do it man i mean lately i've been getting uh hit up about all kinds of different shit, and it's not really about hitting a person up you have to be persistent you know you have to pay your dues you have to take your job and it'll happen to you it'll happen for you it's all love, man. Shout out to Jiggy Jaguar, people like that, that are paving the way and showing love. Hit up these people up. Right now, people can be here. You know, you can be here, you can meet after more. You can meet people like me, people that promote Be on this red carpet. But they don't want to do it. You know, they want to. <laughs> I'm just talking That's to right. these guys. These guys are getting hit up tonight for tickets. The show starts in an hour. What are you doing hitting after more up for tickets, man? It's shit like that that we be talking about, man. You know? I am so glad that you're so shy about your feelings. Yeah, man, I try to hide my feelings and how I really feel. Yeah, man, just walk through the interview, man. It's nothing. You know? just, hey, no, 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 fuck that. You in the interview, no. You in the interview, yeah, now. Man, just walk through the interview. Park it. You know, red carpet. Park. What is going on talk, here? Talk. This is why you don't Shout play this city. Shout out to these city. two people. I'm going to buy these two people a drink. <laughs> Because they didn't, they didn't walk through the motherfucker. They didn't walk you know, through the motherfucker. Like, give side, me a hug. You know. Let me, hold on, let me walk through it. Let me walk through it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's, that's that. Well, got a brother, I always enjoy Somebody got their outfit just today. All right. Thanks for watching, G.